Oh, hey. These are dark times, my friend. I thought for a moment you were one of those dreadful goat men. Since you're not, would you like to buy something? She's not here to kill me. Wanna buy something? <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. If you can. Well, I guess I'm cl I'm I'm basically clearing the forest, so it would be safe for you to leave and um sell the stuff. Uh, but I can also sell my junk here too. Oops, what did I just sell? Eh, not, not worth it. Uh, oh, that's a wizard hat. Literally. <laughs> not worth the defense increase. Uh, that's a direct upgrade. I don't need that. An orb. Uh, I like the defense right now. What about boots? Nope. Pants? Nope. Belt? Nope. Ah, why am I selling the blue stuff? I could salvage those. Well, I already have a crud ton of um, materials. In the stash anyway, so. Thank you for helping me fight the darkness. To contend with evil is the essence of what it means to be a Templar. There is so much more in this universe. Oops. Oh, whatever. I didn't see anything big. So I'm just gonna sell. What does she have, though? Hmm. Nothing really worth it. But yeah, I gotta remember to disenchant that stuff. Even though I don't, I have more mats than I know what to do with. Ow! You jerk. Oh, you missed. All right, that's the way to go later. Uh, this guy have anything cool? I heard that. was my decreases melee damage taken by 20% Ooh. Uh, I forgot how good that was The wizard cast diamond armor. I mean, cuts his toenails. Would that would the toenails stay diamond? I mean, could you then use that diamond toenails to make lots of money? Is that how wizards get rich? I'm not quite sure how it works. 
have to try that in like a D&D campaign. <laughs> Alright, uh, of course we missed right over the waypoint. Picked the wrong time to jump out, dude. Now you activate. There's Goatman over there. I got this. Oh, there's three of them there. Holy cow. Jeez. Uh, there's a farm there. Okay. Weird. Oh, hey, there's a. I am undone. Demon spawn have taken root in my fields. That's usually a sign to leave. <laughs> this land is all my family has. I cannot leave. You're just standing out here the whole time, not even fighting back. How did you survive this long? I don't have enough arcane power. There's one. Get, get rid of them before. Not ready yet. Get rid of another one. There's a gold one. No, 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 no. Okay. I got him. Sickle Fang. Oh, man. Spectrish Blades is awesome. My land is saved. Bless you. Tristram's families will not starve thanks to the work we have done today. No, oh, thank you for having that awesome mustache. Uh -oh. Treasure golem in there. Oh, dang, I died. I got greedy. That's what I mean by you have to watch out for those plants. Because they do a lot of damage, even on just medium. Okay, ready? We are going to freeze them. A chance for glory. Oh, yeah. I makes up for dying. <laughs> oh man, dang it! I was doing so well there. Uh, uh, in f 
from further playing, death only lowers the durability on all your weapons. But as far as I can tell, that's that's the only downside. Well, that and um, there's a bonus. Where is it? If you look here, and. Uh, every monster kill grants up to 12 additional experience. I think this thing. That could be that could be the bonus from the from my equipment. Maybe my equipment increases that bonus, but I thought for sure there's a bonus that the more monsters you kill without dying, the higher momentum experience you have. And obviously, the longer you go without dying, the more, more experience momentum you get and whatnot, if that makes sense. But after reading it a second time, I think it sounds like that experience just comes from the equipment that I have on. I think it's just the equipment I have on that's preventing me from... Oh, I'm missing. It's the equipment I have on that's giving me that bonus XP. So maybe other than... Obviously, if you're on hardcore, you would have just permanently lost everything on your character, but... Other than durability, there's no downside to dying. Was in Diablo 2, you had to actually go find your body naked and refight through all the stuff that you just fought. But I, I'm okay that they took away took away that that it made it easier because yeah, you know, for the sake of time, I don't want to have to fight through all that again, you know. Besides, if you're on a hardcore, it's kind of kind of a moot point. Uh, let's see, those are the Crypt Explorer, so... It's just time to go fight the Glowing Shard. Oh, it's a unique. Yeah. See. Uh, okay. Um. Yeah, I think we're good. I like the music for the for this cave. This cultist. Get in and on with the goat men. Is that how goat men are created? Look, I, I know cultists are into freaky stuff, but I don't know if I want to know what's going on in here. Yeah, oh, I almost walked in that. Tell me to kill him. Oh, this. Hey, hey, guys. With the ritual. Manda will be here soon. It is turning. Your I need our things are weak. I missed. This flows <laughs> with the stranger's magic. Who are you to take what is mine? Yours. I believe you are mistaken. Regardless, I have claimed it. I am Magda, and I lead this coven. The shard is mine. To hell with you, witch. Very well. Let the 
games begin. You say so. Well fought, but you will never possess the next piece. It has fallen where only the ancients may tread. She is more devious than she appears. Your face is ancient. <laughs> well. are still going. Well then. I'm glad that fate has brought her on this path. Why is that? You fight with both honor and ferocity. I know that a pure soul must burn within you. Okay, so, uh, Nutristam. We are not the only ones seeking the sword. I had to take the first piece from a witch named Magda and her crazed minions. Uncle Deckard, you sound like those dark cultists you told me about. Very good, Leia. You have been paying attention. Stranger, does any of this jar your memory? I have no memory of this coven, but I sense a far darker shadow guiding its hand. Huh. Magda's coven is a remnant of an ancient religion called the Triune that worshipped the prime evils as gods. But the prime evils died 20 years ago. Who does the coven worship now? The last two evils, Asmodan and Belial, remain. And if either of them are behind this coven, then our troubles are only beginning. This fragment seems very old, and very powerful. Indeed, it feels familiar to me, though the rest is still unclear. Your sword would seem to mark you as a great champion. If that is what I am, then my strength has gone with my memory. Perhaps when the sword is complete, it will restore both. Perhaps. Magda taunted me. Claiming to know where the next piece is. She said it fell where only ancients may tread. That makes me think of the drowned temple near the festering woods. I remember you telling yeah. me about it, Uncle. Exactly, Leia. The temple was home to the Nephilim. Leia, your knowledge could be Leia. valuable. You must go and help our friend retrieve the sword piece. The Nephilim were ancient humans. Oh, does she have to come? Powers. Legend holds that they waged a terrible battle near the temple, and that their ghosts still war with one another. Huh. It doesn't feel right being in Uncle Deckard's room when he's not here. Oh, this is about to get awkward. This is my room. Do you like it? What? You're not really thinking of reading my journal, are you? No. Uncle Deckard believes the key to unlocking the stranger's memory is reassembling his sword. I wish I could say this was another of Uncle's crazy theories, but I can't deny that these ominous events are starting to really scare me. Let's see now. 
um, off screen. I'm, I'm also playing through as the Demon Hunter. Just on my own personal time. And I unlock the, the Gem Crafter. Who, like the Blacksmith, can be leveled up. To learn new recipes and stuff. And what he does is... He is like the Huraja Cube from Diablo 2. Where he combines gems you find in the wild. Unfortunately, they took out the cool gems like skulls and and diamonds and stuff like that. In this game, there's only four different gems. There's, uh, I forget, what are the four gems? Oh yeah, uh, ruby, topaz, emerald, and amethyst. And they do all specific stuff based on how strong they are. But he can he can combine combine uh, gems for you, which is pretty cool. And you can train them up as well. Uh, I won't, I won't. You, you, you find them in uh, Act 2, but I won't show you how until you actually get there. But, yeah, that's why he's here. Such a strange place this world is. Uh, you never know what you might find over the next rise, or what the next day might bring. A man who fell from the sky, a king who cannot die. I can tell I will have no dull days traveling with you. All I'm going to say is, he's the best character in the game. Easily it makes up for... <laughs> what they did with... What 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 they do with Leia's character. Uh, did I pick up anything new? Dang it, I always do that. 1% chance to block. I like the magic fine. Oh, I picked up a ring of slaughter. Wounding. It's not bad, I guess. I well. What about him? Can I increase his shield? Not really. What about his weapon? Broad axe. Oh yeah, let's upgrade that. 10 to 13 plus 4 to 5. Yeah, let's give him that. Okay. Just the thing. Let's go. 